Hey guys, so today is a very interesting day because I'm making this video about a game, a new Grand Theft Auto game. Yeah, that's right. It's called as Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories, uh, which I played on my PlayStation 2, if I remember correctly. But yeah, it is now available for iOS devices and it will be soon available for uh, the uh, Android devices. So I do have more Android phones than I have these iPhones. I actually have two iPhones, 6 and a 6S. So I'm gonna make the, the, the same type of uh, review of this game on the 6 also, so make sure you check that video out for its performance. So, so basically this game will cost you Six ninety nine? No, it's uh, around. It's maybe around like four ninety nine, maybe. Yeah, but uh, it, it will cost you four ninety nine or uh, six ninety nine in the app store. I think it's four ninety nine. Uh, but you know, I actually bought this game um, one week ago, and uh, and I'm really sorry that I'm making this video late because I got very very sick. So I'm just gonna skip this, and as you can see here. Liberty City Stories and uh, first I'm just going to show you that if we go into options so we get this controls and game settings but we can't really uh, change the uh, graphics or anything like that uh, we have target mode uh, targeting mode, drive, drive by mode, 3D touch run so this also integrates the, the, the this also takes advantage of that the 3d touch we have on the iPhone 6s so you can see 3d touch break um, and also the 3d touch run so I'm just gonna turn them on uh, so you know when you press harder your phone uh, your character will sprint so sorry I'm making a lot of botches but uh, yeah I'm really sleepy at the moment but let's try out the game right quickly start new game okay, so I'm just gonna skip this Wow, look at that. You're looking very nice. The thing is that uh, that this game will run at 60 FPS on iPhone 6s and the 6s Plus, you know, devices with the Apple A9 chipset. And wow, it's really looking like. It's 60 FPS. Look at that. Wow, very smooth. So buttery, buttery smooth. Not a single lag or any frame drop, I should say. God, this is insane performance. I mean, like I said, Apple did really great job uh, when it comes to you know optimizing applications. Wow, it's so smooth. I mean, I, I just want this performance, this smoothness on Android phones, um, which I think is possible if they do the optimization. So I'm just going to go back and do a little jump. Let's forget it. I think I played it uh, with the cheat codes. 
I mean, it's it becomes really hard um, at a certain point. I mean, in some missions, I don't remember, but it's looking very, very nice on iPhone 6s. So definitely, this game is worth it. Worth your money. Buy it from the App Store and definitely you will see awesome performance if you have iPhone 6s or even the 6 definitely this game is worth it so we are back to the same track Wow. Oops. You can see here everything is extremely smooth. Wow. I mean, it really is 60 FPS. We're probably going to get the same type of performance on the 6s plus um, I don't have the 6s plus but uh, but the 6s does have the same internals as the 6s plus just the uh, size so yeah you can see it's performing very very nice So yeah, uh, that was a quick uh, review of the GTA Liberty City Stories for iOS. Uh, tested it out on the iPhone 6s here. So also if you want to see the performance on the iPhone 6, you can check my channel out. And if you guys enjoyed it, please like this video and also please subscribe for daily tech videos. And peace out.